Hey, I'm Jake Steinfeld, the Body by Jake. And uh, I gotta tell you, we're here in Marina Del Rey at the Jamba Juice, and we're, we're, we're live. And I'm sitting with Brendan Brazier, uh, the author of Thrive Foods. And uh, the new Thrive is coming in March of 2014. Great to meet you, buddy. Hey, Good you seeing you. Thanks, Jake. Now, you're a two-time Canadian 50K ultra marathon guy. What is it like to train? It's time consuming. <laughs> <laughs> um, it's just, I mean, the great thing about long events like that is that the more you put in, the better you get. It's really that simple. So talk about this plant-based nutrition that you are so well known for. Well, there's not a lot of refined foods in it. There's, there's no like white flour or anything like that. So it goes beyond just eliminating uh, meat and dairy. It's really eating more whole food. You spend less energy digesting and assimilating foods because you just you eat foods that digest naturally better. What's the biggest challenge that you have? You train a lot of professional athletes as well, right? Uh, for, for the UFC, uh, NFL guys, Major League Baseball guys. Each has to train a little differently for each sport. Yeah, absolutely. So I work with their trainers, and their trainers make up their, their specific plan. I put together the nutrition, which does vary from sport to sport a bit, but maybe not as much as some people would think, because the overarching principles are the same. The quantity they're going to eat is going to be different, but uh, reducing inflammation, for example, it's another huge one that is a benefit to anyone. When you eat more greens, alkaline-forming foods, that chlorophyll that's, that's in the greens, brings down inflammation, which increases muscle functionality, which means you can move uh, more efficiently. You don't spend as much like energy. What would be something, a great breakfast, for moms to know right now, so they get their kids off to school, feel good about, oh, I'm doing something positive for my kids, I'm not gonna get them jacked up. Well, I think smoothies are great, whether it's with juice or it's just blending some fruit, so plant-based protein, hemp protein, pea protein, rice protein, flax, chia, anything like that, blend it in and that's gonna stabilize blood sugar. Talk about the Thrive Book series. I wrote my first book, that was a self-published book back in 2004, and then it right. evolved into a much thicker book that had 100 recipes. It talks about my nutritional philosophy um, and how it can apply mostly to performance, boosting performance, and not necessarily just athletic performance, but uh, mental clarity, um, performance in general. Like It doesn't have to be sport specific. Um, and then this book here, it's mostly recipes, this one. This one has about 200 recipes. But the first third of this book is actually where I look at environmental resources used in food production. So land, water, fossil fuel, and then relate it to, to food. Um, Brendan, man, outstanding. Stuffed yeah, mushrooms. Like <laughs> I, look at this. I love this. And this is available on the website as well? Yeah, or you can get it at, um, yeah, on Amazon or Barnes & Noble. Barnes & Noble. Anywhere, yeah. This is over 200 recipes. Tell me about the new book coming out uh, March 14. So it's called Thrive Energy Cookbook, and it's the, the thing that's different about that is it's all full color. So it's got amazing photos. Um, and again, the same nutritional great. philosophy, reduces inflammation, all plant-based, speeds recovery. What or, exactly is Vega? Tell, t tell me about that. So it's an all-in-one. So it's protein, essential fats, fiber, greens, enzymes, probiotics, vitamins, minerals, the whole the whole while. And it's available at Whole Foods? Is it available on your website? Yeah, the website as well, myvega.com. Myvega, V-E-G-A, yep. dot com. Okay, right. great. Good stuff. Hey, I appreciate you stopping by, man. Ain't no problem. It was Thanks really for having cool. me. So I said, stick to the fight. When your hardest hit, it's when things seem worst, that you must not quit. Yeah.